We all know blood is vital. It's the life force that keeps us going, coursing through our veins and arteries, delivering essential elements to every part of our body. It carries oxygen and nutrients throughout our bodies, ensuring that our organs function properly and that we have the energy to live our daily lives. But did you know your blood type is like a fingerprint? It's unique to you. Just like no two fingerprints are the same, no two blood types are exactly alike. It's determined by tiny markers on the surface of your red blood cells called antigens. These antigens are like little flags that identify your blood type. These antigens aren't just identifying markers, they play a crucial role in your immune system, helping your body recognize which cells belong to you and which are foreign invaders. They play a role in your health. For instance, certain blood types are more susceptible to specific diseases, while others might offer some protection against them. Scientists are discovering more and more about how your blood type can influence your risk for certain diseases. Research is ongoing, and new findings are constantly emerging. Understanding your blood type can be a powerful tool. It can provide insights into your health risks and help you take preventive measures. This knowledge can help you make informed decisions about your health and well-being. For example, knowing your blood type can be crucial in emergency situations where blood transfusions are needed. Let's dive in and explore the fascinating world of blood types together. By understanding more about this vital aspect of our biology, we can better appreciate the complexity and wonder of our own bodies. There are four main blood types, A, B, AB, and O. Each type is defined by the presence or absence of the A and B antigens on red blood cells. Blood type A, you have a antigens on your red blood cells. Blood type B, you have B antigens on your red blood cells. Blood type AB, you have both A and B antigens. Blood type O, you have neither A nor B antigens, but that's not all. There's another important factor called the RH factor. This factor adds another layer of complexity to blood typing. Your blood type is determined by your genes. You inherit these genes from your parents just like you inherit your eye or hair color. If one parent has blood type A and the other has blood type B, you could inherit either A or B or even a combination resulting in type AB. This genetic inheritance is why certain blood types are more common in specific ethnic groups. For example, blood type B is more common in people of Asian descent. Understanding this genetic link can be helpful. It helps us understand the potential health risks and benefits associated with each blood type. People with blood type A are thought to be descended from early farmers. They adapted to a more agrarian lifestyle and a diet rich in grains and vegetables. This blood type is associated with certain personality traits like being organized, detail-oriented, and natural caregivers. However, blood type A individuals may also be more prone to stress and have sensitive digestive systems. They often benefit from stress-reducing activities like yoga and meditation. Consuming a balanced diet rich in fruits, vegetables, and lean proteins is also beneficial. Section 5. Blood Type A and Health – What You Need to Know Recent studies suggest that people with blood type A might be at a slightly higher risk for certain health conditions. This information is crucial for understanding how your blood type can influence your overall health and well-being. These conditions include heart disease where blood type A individuals may be more prone to blood clotting, potentially increasing the risk of heart attacks. It's important to be aware of these risks so you can take proactive steps to protect your heart health. There's also some research suggesting a possible link between blood type A and an increased risk of stomach and pancreatic cancer. While these findings are still being explored, it's a good idea to stay informed and discuss any concerns with your healthcare provider. Remember, these are just associations observed in studies. They do not guarantee that you will develop these conditions, but they highlight the importance of regular health screenings and being vigilant about any changes in your health. Having blood type A doesn't mean you'll definitely develop these conditions, it simply means you might have a slightly higher risk, and being aware of this can help you make more informed health choices. It's essential to maintain a healthy lifestyle through diet, exercise, and regular checkups. Eating a balanced diet rich in fruits and vegetables, staying physically active, and scheduling regular medical checkups can significantly reduce your risk of developing these health issues. Additionally, managing stress and avoiding smoking or excessive alcohol consumption are crucial steps in maintaining overall health. By understanding the potential risks associated with blood type A and taking proactive measures, you can lead a healthier, more informed life. 
Knowledge is power, and being aware of your blood type's potential impact on your health allows you to take control and make positive changes. Stay informed, stay proactive, and prioritize your health. Whether it's through regular exercise, a nutritious diet, or routine health screenings, every step you take towards a healthier lifestyle can make a significant difference. Remember, your blood type is just one piece of the puzzle, and with the right approach, you can optimize your health and well-being. Section 6, Blood Type B, The Adaptable Explorers. Blood Type B is thought to have originated in nomadic tribes of Central Asia. These individuals thrived on a diet rich in dairy and meat. This blood type is often linked to characteristics like creativity, flexibility, and a strong immune system. People with blood type B are believed to have a good balance of mental and physical strength. However, they may be more susceptible to autoimmune disorders and certain infections. They often benefit from a balanced lifestyle that includes both physical activity and mental stimulation. Section 7 Blood Type B and Health Staying Balanced Research suggests that blood type B individuals may have a lower risk of certain cancers. Some studies indicate a potential lower risk of certain cancers including lung and colorectal cancer. On the flip side, blood type B has been linked to a higher risk of autoimmune disorders like lupus and multiple sclerosis. Maintaining a balanced lifestyle is crucial for individuals with blood type B. This balance includes a healthy diet, regular exercise, and stress management. Section 8 Blood Type AB The Rare Blends Blood Type AB is the rarest blood type. It's considered a modern blood type, emerging from a mix of type A and type B. People with this blood type are often described as rational, level-headed, and adaptable. They possess a unique blend of traits from both A and B blood types. However, individuals with blood type AB may be more susceptible to certain health challenges. These challenges include a higher risk of blood clots and cognitive decline. Section 9. Blood Type AB and Health – A Closer Look Studies suggest that blood type AB individuals may have an increased risk of cognitive decline. Research shows a possible link between blood type AB and an increased risk of memory problems and cognitive decline later in life. They could also be more prone to blood clots. Like blood type A, individuals with AB may have a slightly higher risk of blood clotting, potentially impacting cardiovascular health. It's crucial for individuals with blood type AB to maintain a healthy lifestyle. This lifestyle includes a balanced diet, regular exercise, and mental stimulation to support cognitive function. Section 10. Blood Type O – The Universal Donors Blood Type O is the most common blood type. Individuals with this blood type are considered universal donors because their blood lacks both A and B antigens. This characteristic makes their blood compatible with all other blood types. People with blood type O are often described as practical, assertive, and natural leaders. While generally considered healthy, blood type O individuals may be more susceptible to certain infections and ulcers. However, they often benefit from regular exercise and a diet rich in lean protein. Section 11, Blood Type O and Health, The Protective Factor Blood type O, often referred to as the universal donor, has been the subject of numerous studies due to its unique characteristics and potential health benefits. Research suggests that blood type O individuals may have a lower risk of heart disease. This protective factor is thought to be linked to the lower levels of certain proteins in the blood that can cause clotting, which in turn reduces the risk of heart attacks and strokes. Studies suggest that blood type O may be associated with a lower risk of heart disease compared to other blood types. This is particularly significant as heart disease remains one of the leading causes of death worldwide. The lower risk is not just a minor statistical anomaly, but a significant finding that has been replicated in multiple studies across different populations. However, they could be more vulnerable to certain infections. This increased susceptibility is thought to be due to the lack of certain antigens in the blood, which can make it easier for bacteria and viruses to invade the body. Blood type O individuals may be more susceptible to bacterial infections like E. coli and ulcers. These infections can be particularly severe and may require more aggressive treatment. It's important for individuals with blood type O to be aware of these risks and take preventive measures. Maintaining a healthy lifestyle is essential for everyone regardless of blood type. Regular exercise, a balanced diet, and routine medical checkups are crucial components of a healthy life. 
However, individuals with blood type O may benefit from extra attention to hygiene and incorporating foods that promote gut health into their diet. Probiotic-rich foods, such as yogurt and fermented vegetables, can help maintain a healthy balance of bacteria in the gut, which is particularly important for those who may be more susceptible to infections. Additionally, good hygiene practices, such as regular hand washing and avoiding contact with sick individuals, can help reduce the risk of infection. By taking these extra precautions, individuals with blood type O can better protect themselves and maintain their overall health.